The new year brought with it cold, bitter weather. Thousands of Syrian refugees living in Lebanon woke up to snow and strong winds, making their bad situation worse. Abu Hamada struggles to keep the whole family warm. He fled Aleppo with his wife and eight of their ten children two years ago. When his two daughters lost their husbands in the war, they both followed with their children. Fifteen of them now live in one tent, and winter is more than a struggle. Across the Biqa Valley, many refugees live in tents and unfinished buildings. Aid agencies distribute fuel and shelter reinforcement months ahead of winter. But bad weather can damage tents and cause settlements to flood. The number of years that refugees have stayed here means that they're facing increased vulnerabilities. All of their savings have been depleted. Uh, many have moved into the settlements because they're cheaper than living in flats or apartments in town. They're not used to these conditions. Um, it is practically impossible to find a job and therefore they have no income and are totally reliant on resources from humanitarian agencies. Nawal is one of Abu Hamada's daughters. She fled to Lebanon with her three children after her parents did. Another year ends, and this family, like many others, are far from going home. They brave yet another winter in Lebanon, but hope it would be their last.